Beautiful sunrise. Hold on, wait up. Todd's trying to fucking leave me, he's a little bitch. He knows I'm talking shit, he's staring at me. Todd, if you're watching this, I'm talking mad shit about you right now. We're about to go save someone. About to save someone's life. I was like, yo, Todd, that swan looks like he's frozen in the ice. And now we're gonna go see if the swan's frozen in the ice. Yeah, he's frozen, huh? Holy shit. I knew it, I was right. I'm always right. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Fishing with Becca. Link down below. Oh, that looks hella sketchy. He's not stuck? Good morning, sunshine. Cool. He looked frozen, huh? Yep. 100%. I'm, I'm walking over here thinking, like, what am I gonna do? Yeah, I know. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> yep. There's definitely a fish on there. Yeah. Yeah. Feels like a oh, oh. Dang it. It's all right. First fish of the day. Got him in the snoot, I think. I'm not even oh, mad close. though. It's, it's a start. Holy crap! Did I get him good? Yeah. Nice. You like that hook set? Oh my God, feel him, be feel his belly. Chowing. There's a bluegill in there, I can tell you that. Oh. Ah! <laughs> first fish of the day, first ice fish ever in my dream pond to ice fish, and it's a pickerel. It's really ironic, we're gonna let him go. What's going on everybody? Welcome to another episode of Fishing Grubs next to a road that's loud. It's uh, one of my favorite additions. Anyways, uh, we are out here. We got Becca. Yeah. And uh, we're about to start jigging. We put flags out. This is a place Becca's wanted to fish through the ice her whole life and never has gotten to. So it's, uh, it's actually really exciting that we're here today doing this. See if we can't catch us some fish. I got uh, this little jig we're gonna throw on and uh, bounce around from hole to hole seeing if we can't mark anything before we set up shop. Let's do this. Oh, whoa, big mark. Big mark and big fish. Huge fish, Becca. Huge. Huge, huge, huge. Monster head shakes. Oh, I've just popped off. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. There it is. A slow roll. A slow roll. Got him? Yeah, feels small. No. Not like super small, but definitely small. Small bass. Small bass. Just give us a green. I want a greeny. I want a largey. Wow, did it? It took out a little bit of line. Yay! No way! Todd, you caught a bass! We did it. We did it, <laughs> homie! <laughs> Hell yeah! 
I want a picture? No. 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 I'm devastated still. But cool, cute little guy after missing one about 14 times that size. Oh. See ya. See ya. Well, got my first jigged up fish of the day. Not the size of the first one we hooked, but it's a fish. Holy crap. Kick it, kick it, kick it, kick it. Oh, hold on. Which way is it going? It's going that way. Okay. Oh, he just stopped. No, he's gone. Got him. Wow, we almost spooled the thing. Let's try and slow down just a little bit. He's running like right at me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, I'm not, I don't want to jinx myself, but it feels massive. I told you, if anyone was gonna catch a big bass today, it was gonna be you. Oh my god! Oh. Sick. Oh, dude. Dude. Oh my god. Look at that shiner down the gullet. Holy crap. I'm Great. shaking. That's a freaking giant. I didn't want to say anything, but the whole fight I knew it was a big fish. Yeah, it's a nice fish. Long too. She's not like super thick, but she's long, you know? To be able to catch a fish ice fishing out of my childhood dream ponds ice fish is so surreal. Um, I'm not really sure how this explained it, but I feel so good right now. This is a very solid fish right here. Beautiful fish, let him go. Ah, oh, thank you. You made my freaking dream come true. Oh my God, let go, dude. Oh, I feel so good. Woo! Oh, soldier. Guys, we drilled 400,000 oh, holes, but we finally just found the honey hole. Yeah, this We're is, here. This is dumb. We, we did it. I gotta get the auger. Uh, I caught this little crappie. Let's catch a couple more fish real quick and then go get the auger. There we go. We'll take turns. Crappie? Oh, that's not small. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, why that look huge? Todd just caught a crappie. I just caught three gills back to back. There's probably 5,000 fish on the freaking screen. Like, it's not even normal. The ground is not moving. It is normal. Fish. That's what we need. All that red is fish. It's not 10 foot, though. It is. Is it? Yeah, it's 10 feet. I said this is 10 feet, and then I hooked up. No, you got one? Yeah. This is insane. <laughs> This is awesome. About damn time. Took us all day. All day. Oh, there's a big mark on it. No, you son of a... Let's get him back in there. There we go. Oh. Mm. Kill. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. <laughs> this is ridiculous. There's something there I could have done better. I don't know what it was, but. There's always stuff you can do better. That's why life is a learning process. Oh, that felt big. The learning process. God damn it. No. We got to drill uh, another hole next to this hole badly. Oh, God. You got one? Yeah, I got him. It's okay. It's all right. You got him? Yeah. a nice gill. <laughs> <laughs> I, I know. 
My reel's messed up. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh, yeah baby. We did it, Todd. Hopefully they don't move on us. He was digging. <laughs> That's a trap size. Boy, they were here fierce. They were here, where'd they go? Now look at the screen. That's just Todd and I making those marks. Beck is gonna catch both of the giants today. I missed my opportunity. Oh, grab him. <laughs> nice fish. Not as big as the last one, but that's a nice fish. I've never caught a bass that big through the ice, so. Oh my God, I just caught this thing jigging. That's oh sick. my god. Oh, a wax worm too. Uh, mealworm. Mealworm. Oh my god, dude. Alright, Becca. Let's see that butte. Oh. This is my biggest bass ever. Jigging. This is my new personal best. Bass of the ice jigging right here. Large mouth. Beautiful fish right here. I'm so sure. Let's send her back home. He, her. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that was so delayed. The shiners are right there. What? Oh, I threw yours in the hole. I didn't think you wanted it anymore. <laughs> in the hole. I'm gonna see if I can upsize with this water clarity being so fucking murky. Blade bait? Oh, sick. Is that, was that Mr. Tackle? Um, uh, might have been I, I Monster Ass Icebox. Yeah, I got that exact one with Mr. Tackle last year. What? Well, I, uh, I never really commit to one of these. Yeah, but the big bass have bit today. They're definitely on the prowl for some yums. Got him. Little guy. Still a bass though. Nice. On the blade bait. Sick. I watched him. I watched him come up on the screen. I guess upsizing might be the way to go though. He hammered it. Oh man. Did he like choke it? No, but he had both both sets of trebles. Oh. Look at how good I got him. That's, That's sick. On the blade bait, baby. On the freaking blade bait. Gold blade bait. Got it in the monster bass uh, ice fishing box, guys. So fucking cool. Code Todd Grubbs the best. That's your first fish on the rod that I got you. Yep. First fish on the rod Becca got me for... Oh. Christmas. For Christmas. Thanksgiving. For all of the above. Yep. And it's a nice little bassy bass. I don't use it much because it's it's for a bigger, well, I, it's for bigger, bigger gear because she knew I already had the the, the light stuff. Yes. Wow, what a beaut. What a beaut. All right, little bud. Thanks. So you, you have no idea how much you mean to me, my little buddy. Oh, 
I'm marking a fish down here. Yep. Yeah, the, it's, the blade bait's too big. Got him though. Yeah, dude. What? The crappie on the blade bait. <laughs> There's a pack of them down here. Okay. Whoa. That was dope, guys. Dope, dope, dope. Go ahead, little bud. Sick. Yeah, nice little guy. This is a nice little one. Sick, dude. Alright, adios, buddy. See awesome. Ya. Sweet. That's my first fish of the day. Holy shit. I knew it. I knew it. He smoked it. He come out of nowhere. Listen, you gotta chill out, little bud. That scared the shh. Yeah, just like <laughs> no, nothing, and then a big red slash. Boom. Yeah. Okay, go, 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 go. Going, going. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. He's going fast. I guarantee it's a thicker one, but it's a big gill, though. Oh, it's a big gill. Then it's a big bass, <laughs> or a big pickerel. You got it's him? Big something. Oh boy. Holy shit. Oh boy. No, it spit it. Oh. Two headshakes. Pop, pop. No. Gone. Gone. Yep. No. Yep. I would have done the same thing. That was the worst. I would have ripped it hard. When I got, I would have grabbed the line and just like that. Yeah, we're not we, used to sending, we sending need a it. hook hard. Yeah, yeah we should so probably do hooks. that. Yeah, exactly. Well, well the ones that you, like, are they, um, the ones that you gave me were, um, like, wacky, wacky, right? No, that's just that fucking yes, thought came back. Oh, man. Oh, it could happen. Oh, bros. That was huge. Pop, pop. Two head shakes. Gone. Shit, he was going with it, too. Could have been the six or the seven or the eight or the nine. Or I never used bluegills 50? on a tip up before, so yeah. we not. yeah we gotta set the fucking hook. Yeah, because yeah, we wanted to rip through the bluegills back and into there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so we because he was he had it in his mouth. Yeah, I mean he was he was spinning that thing. Oh, he fucking was gone, dude. Oh my lord. This place always just kicks your butt. Look at the mm. the muck. Is there teeth marks? It's probably a bass. I haven't seen it too close. The gill's kind of... He's not doing too well. <laughs> I, wonder, <laughs> I wonder if the fish killed it or if it ate it dead. It, honestly, I think they would eat... Oh, he's still swimming. Oh, he's good. He's, yeah. he's chilling. He's trying. They got your bait? You savage! <laughs> savage! Savage bluegill. <laughs> that is ridiculous, bro. Is the one with the hook in the mouth? Yep. Wow. Yep. Look at that. Savage. <laughs> Holy shit, right there. Wow. Savage. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that concludes the day on the water. One thing I forgot to mention out on the water, I never introduced you guys to Jeremy. The other gentleman that joined 
Becca and I, his name is Jeremy Cruz. He is the master caster on YouTube and Instagram. Please go check him out. I'll leave him linked down below. Jeremy is the man. Him and I have been talking to each other for the past, I don't know, probably since I started my YouTube channel. And uh, this kid catches so many different species of fish. He's from down in Pennsylvania, and the kid is freaking unbelievable. He puts together great videos. He's just an insane multi-species angler, so please, please, please do me a favor and go check him out. Also, if you're new to the channel here, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell as well. We drop videos every single weekday. Make sure to go over to Becca's channel and subscribe to her as well. Also, guys, we got a giveaway going on right now, so we'll leave that video linked right here. Go check it out. Enter the giveaway. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's episode. Let me tell you something. What you guys see on the video sometimes compared to what we went through during the day is night and day. This day, although we caught some big fish, we lost a lot of big fish that we hooked. It also was a struggle bus for like the whole first half of the day. Like we did not get on fish all day. They were sporadic. We got a fish here and there, but we really didn't start like hitting fish until the end of the day. Um, and that's when we caught the most amount of fish was right at the very end. It was a very, very, very tough day on the water, but we had our goal and we stayed and we capitalized. And lucky for us, Becca landed two big, big old bass. So we had a blast out there. Of course, it would have been better if I got to land one of the three big bass that I hooked into, but you know what? It happens, it happens, and it happens more often than you would ever think after being able to get that aqua view down and to actually check out what is really going on down there. So guys, uh, we will catch you tomorrow. Make sure you go sign up for the giveaway and we'll talk to you later. Fish out. Wonder if all my bad decisions get accounted in the algorithms. No statistician could dissuade me from my bigger vision. I know my occupation's quite an unlikely place in this world to occupy and talk about upon a daily basis. Our information's predetermined by some biased business. We all in sermon to silicon that push out lovely neighbors. I'm done with paper chasing, think I'm on the bigger banquets. Miss that full circle, new wave, energy on a Tuesday.